that fire alarm Sam is always cool and calm If you're stuck, give him a shout He'll be there to help you out So move aside, make way for Fireman Sam Cause he's gonna save the day Fireman Sam cause he's pretty to the core Sam is the hero next door Okay, cadets Today, we're going to be doing some exercises in teamwork. And we're going to start with a race. <laughs> I love races. That's funny, because you always lose. Oh. Whoa, whoa, don't start, you two. We've got a lot to do today. And this isn't a usual type of race. It's an obstacle course. <laughs> Easy peasy. Ah, but remember, today is all about teamwork, so you're going to be doing it as a three-legged race. Ah, uh, but I've only got two legs. No, Norman, your leg is going to be tied to your teammate's leg. I'm with Andy! Hello, Teamy! No! <laughs> He'll make me stick to the Right. You can use these to tie your legs together. Uh, you'd better not slow me down, James. Mandy always beats me at races, and it's about time I showed her who is the fastest. There we go. All ready for the wild men of Ponty Pandy? <laughs> Wilderness feast. And it's all going to be fresh and forage from the wild. Well, apart from the hot dogs, ketchup, buns, marshmallows and some watermelons, we got all those from the cut price store. But the berries will be foraged. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah sure, yeah. Eh? Well, well foraged. foraged. So, let's get foraging. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We can't leave the food here. Remember that fox that keeps eating our feasts? Oh, yeah. He's a cunning one. He always gets our food, eh? Do you remember the fox-proof box? And what about the fox-proof hole? And who could forget the fox-proof raft? The problem with all of those things was that they weren't very mm, fox-proof. Uh, but this time, our feast will be completely safe. <laughs> Introducing the fox-proof bag. <gasps> That's brilliant, mate. There's no way that fox is going to get in our feast now. Yeah, so let's go foraging. A foraging, a foraging we will go. go. A foraging we will go. A foraging we will go. Hey, hey, you two, uh, no pushing. Ready, steady, go! <laughs> James, remember the teamwork, Norman. More haste, less speed. So, when I say one, you move your right leg forward and I'll move my left leg. And when you say two, I'll move my left and you move your right. <laughs> We're winning by a mile! Oh, careful, Norman! Uh, no, get off! Uh, no, wait, you just get... Oh. <sighs> Ooh, you OK, kids? Yeah, we're fine. Come on, James. <gasps> Norman, our legs have come untied. That's not my fault. Come on, get up. Let's go. No, Norman. We need to be tied together. It's the rules. Don't you talk to of your rules? Come on, James. Get up. Oh, I'm all back to fronty. One, two, one, two. Quick. <laughs> Can't believe we found a blackberry bush right next to our camp. 
It just doesn't seem to have many berries on her. Well, at least we've got the buns and the hot dogs and the ketchup. Not to mention the marshmallows and the watermelons. Good gravy. Wait, what's that sound? Not sure, mate. It sounds a little bit like tiny teeth gnawing through. Wait a minute. <gasps> My fox-proof bag! Oi, no you don't, you little red rascal. Whoa! Call the fire station. It's okay. We got our bucket of water. Um, I think I will call the fire station. The wild men of Ponty Pandy have been outfoxed by the fox again, and they have started a forest fire. Men of Ponty Pandy have been outfoxed by the fox again, and they've started a forest fire. Sorry, cadets, we need to get to the fire. Wait, stop! Does that mean it's a draw? from your three-legged race, Norman. More haste, less speed. And good teamwork. Cadets, you stay back at a safe distance with me. Right, team. I'll take Venus 2 and drive around the outside of the fire and surround it with sticky foam. Arnold and Sam, you tackle the main blaze with water from Jupiter's hoses. And Elvis, you take care of any smaller fires with a floppy shovel. Right. Indeed. That was amazing! No rushing and loads of teamwork. If we'd been a team like that, Norman, we would have won the three-legged race. Oh, I get it now. I know exactly what to do. I want to race again. Sorry, Norman. We won't be doing any more races today. Aww. We're really sorry we nearly burnt down the whole forest, Penny. Yeah, really sorry. The Wild Men Feast got a little, um, too wild. Well, in future, you wild men need to be a lot more careful around open fires, especially in the forest. Oh, yeah. We will, Penny. Won't happen again. Sorry. Yeah, and I don't suppose any of our feasts survived. I thought I spotted some hot dogs over... Oh! I think maybe next time we have a wild man feast, we feed the fox before we start. <laughs> <laughs>